Okay. Oh, this is really intense. Okay. <laughs> I haven't been active. I know. I'm so sorry. I have a lot of stuff going on. But I am going to start posting on here again. But to break it down, it's going to be more of a family channel. <laughs> okay. Um, news that I want to tell. But I have to tell my boyfriend's family before I can tell the whole world, if that makes sense. But um, I want you guys to know that this video is not going to be posted. Or, well, it's going to be out by the time we tell his family. So I'm just pre-making it. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. So to break it down and get straight to the point, we're having a baby. <sighs> that was hard. <laughs> Posting, it's going to be harder. Okay. Um, so a lot of you guys are thinking, oh my god, 16 and pregnant was supposed to scare you guys, not inspire you. While editing this, I did not realize that I made it sound like it actually inspired me. I did not watch that show. I read that post somewhere about that. So, like, just don't think that it actually inspired me, okay? But one, I'm 19. Two, I feel like it'd be better if I made this choice on my own. And even then, I hear a lot that abortion can mess things up for you in the future. And it could possibly stop you from having children later on in life if you want them. So I'm not going to do that. But, um... Yeah. Um... There are a few people that aren't going to like this. But this is our choice, and we're excited about it. Yeah. So I just kind of wanted to make an announcement that it's no longer going to be a, a vlog channel of just me. It's going to be about the next nine months of what I go through, how far along I am, and our steps in getting our stuff together as a family together. Yeah. So, um, my channel is basically going to cover topics about helping advice with women that are struggling with pregnancy or tips about how to help pregnancy cramps or the pains you get or what foods to eat to stay healthy and to help the baby develop right and grow, grow right. Yeah. Word vomit. Word vomit. Um, grow right, if you know what I meant. It's gonna be me, the baby, and my boyfriend all together. For now, obviously, it's just gonna be me and my boyfriend with the baby in my belt. <laughs> we are gonna be updating on pictures and videos and little things we do and little trips we go on for the baby, like doctor visits and ultrasounds and stuff like that. So I'm sorry that my channel did not go as I planned from the beginning. And if this isn't, this, if this isn't the kind of channel you wanted to subscribe to, you can unsubscribe because I don't want to feel like I'm forcing you to stay subscribe to my channel and even then I'd rather have I don't know I don't want to force you guys to do anything if that makes sense if you'd rather not be subscribed to family vlogs I, I understand just wanted to make that clear to you so yeah um I'm really excited for the next nine months so I am gonna end up changing my YouTube name to a family name instead of just me because I feel like that isn't really covering the whole basis of what my channel is about if it's just me from now on. 
So for the next few days, I'm going to be editing all my social media accounts from just me to my family. Yeah. I'm really excited about this next step in my life. And it's going to be rough. I know that. There's going to be a lot of pain. I know that. And there's going to be struggles. And I know that. So on that note, I... I already went and signed up for EBT and WIT, and a part of me regrets doing it because I'm not one to want to rely on the government for help, if that makes sense. But at the same time, again, I'm only 19, and I am going to learn a lot of new things during this process. And I know... I know it's not always bad needing help, so I really, really hope that nobody hates me for needing help, and I'm sorry if the things I do to get my stuff together you guys don't like. It's nothing bad or illegal, it's just, I know some people don't believe in relying on the government, but it's, uh, in all honesty, it'd be pretty hard working when I wake up every day throwing up, and I only tend to feel good for some reason when the sun goes down and it's nighttime. That's why I feel comfortable staying up at night lately instead of daytime, and I really wish this was easier to explain, but it's not, and I'm sorry. But I really hope you guys understand. So yeah. And although I'm not comfortable, like I said, using the government because I know I can work, just not at this moment in time. I um I wanna add on that I've already tried wig shopping and they gave me the card the other day. It's really confusing. <laughs> I had no idea how to use it. It probably took me three hours in the store to get stuff for chili for dinner. But the cool thing is that they have an app for it. And you can go in and find healthy recipes that help your baby grow right. And I thought that was pretty cool because I had no idea what I was going to make with kidney beans and a block of cheese and random stuff that they let you get, you know. And it was pretty cool because they have a bunch of recipes. They have a barcode that you can scan the barcode stuff with your camera. And it'll tell you if that's WIC approved or not so you can get it. I got a lot of those. <laughs> I had to scan a lot of stuff. And it took a while, but it's actually really helpful for those that might need it. But, um, yeah. Let me fix this. Um... So, on that note, stupid camera. But I would really, really, really enjoy if you guys wanted to be on the journey with me. So yeah, I think that about covers the main basis of everything I was trying to say. And thank you for standing by me through all of this. Oh, bye.